Welcome. This is a quick video to go ahead and install uh, the Homebrew Package Manager on our MacBook Air with a silicon chip. So we're going to uh, install the Package Manager to make it easier for us to install software on our Mac OS. So let's navigate to brew.sh and you can see that this is the installation screen. There's a couple of options here. One of those is to go ahead and run the bash script. The second one is if you're on Mac OS, let's try the new package installer. So let's check that out. We're going to select on that, go to the GitHub release, scroll to the bottom, and we'll see there's the homebrew package manager. We're going to select that. After that finishes downloading, we'll go into our downloads folder. We'll select to install homebrew. Carefully read the license clause. Continue. Agree. We've entered our password to go ahead and install the software and it's installing Homebrew. Now, when we get to this step, notice that it says next steps to add Homebrew to your path. So I'm on a uh, Mac, MacBook Air with an M3. So I have a Z profile. So I want to go ahead and we're going to add this to our Z profile. So we're going to grab this. It says on Apple Silicon. And let's go ahead and put this in our clipboard. We're going to need that. And then we can go ahead and finish this. Go ahead and put move it to trash. And we're basically all set. Go ahead and minimize this. And let's get ourselves a terminal window. Command shift plus. And let's put here what is in the clipboard. Now what we want to do is we want to get this into our uh, Z profile. We want to wrap this in single quotes. So this is all one string. So before the eval, I have a tick mark there. And I'm going to go ahead and have a tick mark at the end. So this is all one string. And I'm going to take that string and I want to go ahead and echo it to the screen. E C H. Oh. Wow. And then I want to take that string that I'm echoing to the screen, but I want to append it to that actual Z profile. So this is my home directory forward slash dot Z profile. And that command will go ahead and do that for me. Right now, you'll see if we go ahead and try a command, let's go uh, brew install hashcat. It's not there. So we're going to go ahead and close this shell, reopen our Z shell. Install Hashcat. And you'll see that it's going ahead and installing Hashcat because I closed the shell. It went in and it reloaded the profile. And now I'm uh, installing the Hashcat password cracker. That finished installing. Looks like everything worked well. And uh, we can go ahead and just type in Hashcat with the help commands. And you'll see we've installed Brew. We've quickly used Brew to install the Hashcat program. And um, this will help you install uh, packages very quickly. Uh, very good package manager for your Mac OS. Thank you.